Hello friends, good afternoon. Today I am going to show very interesting settings in Odoo out of the box to manage a typical use case of multiple warehouse and multiple manufacturing facility whereby your products needed to supply and manufacture in one warehouse facility and certain of your products required to manufacturing another warehouse facility and delivery should be initiated from there. So what can be done? What type of setting is required in order? Let's check that out. So if you can see on my screen, I have created two warehouses. Both have capability to manufacture. Okay. So these are the two warehouse, Oman WH1, Oman WH2. And then we do have routes. So inside the routes, what I have done is I have split the deliveries route and I have enabled sales order lines. And over here in pull from, I remove the warehouse setting from here. So it is blank now. So any delivery from the single sales order, if my route has been selected on sales order, it will come here when I have selected this particular route. Same way, I have disabled this particular, you know, remove this warehouse setting from here and then enable sales order line setting from here. That's why. And then inside the rules, what I have done is over here from warehouse one stop to customer, which is my delivery route. Okay, what I have done is I have changed the supply method from tech from stock to tech from stock if unavailable trigger another rule. In both the rules, this is rule 1 and then this is stock rule 2. I have changed this tag from stock if unavailable trigger another rule. These settings I have made changes of and then I have created reordering rules for my both the item. Like if this item I want to make sure should supply from warehouse 1 stock, it should trigger replenish on order with 00 route automated. And then for this particular product from warehouse to stock, it will trigger uh, this particular automatically again replenish on order. Okay, so these are the route I have set up. Now what I will do is I will simply prepare a quotation. So in quotation, this is the existing quotation which you can see has FG1 WH1 as a product and I have selected route as deliver in one step from warehouse 1 and for FG2 WH2 I have select warehouse 2 as a delivery. Inside my product setting I have simply select replenishment order and manufacture. Same way for the second product also the same thing replenishment order and manufacture. So these settings I have done and now it has triggered two separate delivery. One will be going from warehouse 1, another from warehouse 2 for respective item FG1 and then FG2. Same way you can see it will trigger two manufacturing orders separately to supply. FG1 will be produced from manufacturing 1 uh, facility warehouse 1 manufacturing and then this FG2 will be manufactured from this particular facility. Now, as soon as I, you know, confirm this order, okay, it will plan and uh, do the delivery. I will just say produce all because I haven't set up any, any bomb or anything, but just for the sake of example, I have done this part and inside the delivery now it is in ready state because it is available and I am validating it. So this particular setting will help many people. Now let's trigger another order and I will put FG1, WH1 and here I will select it should prepare in this warehouse only and likewise FG2, WH2 I want to deliver from warehouse 2 I want to deliver 10 units of this and maybe 5 units of this and then I confirm it so based on my entire setting now you can see there are two manufacturing order released okay so this is how it will work for you to split your manufacturing based on your product and route 
for one product and another product will be produced from manufacturing facility too so and you can have two delivery orders so inside your inventory dashboard you can see these delivery orders will be triggered from different different warehouse as well as your manufacturing will be done from different different warehouse hope uh, this setting will help many people to set such a route and uh, the rules logic to help splitting the manufacturing and delivery in from different warehouse from the same sales order and i would like to thank my friend kevin zaki uh, from uh, he has inspired me and uh, shared the logic of delivery split in one of his video in version 15 yeah and uh, yeah thank you very much